Hello and welcome to this video. I'm a lucky man today again because another co-worker uh, gave me this lock that he has found on the street um, and it came with two keys. I think you all know how this uh, lock is supposed to work. It's uh, It locks just one, one wheel of your bike so that you cannot um, uh, drive away with your bicycle, but you can of course uh, carry it away. Um, it is a EXA SL7 and it is made in Holland. Hope you can see that. Made in Holland. Key works uh, very nice. So you stick in the key, turn it clockwise, then you can open the, the circle and key doesn't go out anymore. It's uh, spring-loaded, the core is spring-loaded and it also doesn't uh, lock up automatically so when you drive it's uh, in the open position and it contains the key so you cannot forget your key um, when you want to lock your bike you turn it clockwise you close the, uh, the circle and then you can remove the key very easy, very practical um, I show you the key. It's a um, a wafer lock. It's a reversible key. Um, yeah, and it has some wafers on the top and some on the bottom. Hope you can make this out. Yeah, and of course I wanna pick this now. So stay tuned. So lock is clamped up in the vise. It's Closed and oops, sorry, lock works. Open, closed, locked up. I hope I can show show you what I'm doing. All right. So I use the fattest tension wrench that I have, and I apply tension here at the center part of the of the plug. Because I want to uh, set the wafers on the top and on the bottom at the same time. So here is the half diamond, uh, the first half diamond that I use. Slide over the wafers on the top and on the bottom. And open. That's how fast it is. And just a simple uh, wafer lock. You can see it's open. And locked up again. Alright, so much for the EXA SL7 made in Holland. Thanks for watching. Happy picking. Bye bye.